Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, Dave's Mom. If you are a first timer, I beg, subscribe. Yeah. So guys, today I'm going to be talking about the most scariest moment of my life. Like who? Isn't it like scariest? Can you all shout? But I'm going to talk about the most scariest moment of my life. So it all started this way. When I went to Olumor. Around that time I was like 10 or 11 years, I can't remember sir. When I went to Lumorok. So when we now got there, we we're seeing everywhere mountain. By the way, Abelkuta is filled up with mountains. So big mountains, everything sharp. So when we now go to Abelkuta, Olumorok I mean, we entered, we just see mountains everywhere, 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 everywhere. So when we now got there, by the way, it was an excursion with our school. So when we now got there, they said the elevator was not working again, so we could not climb upstairs. We could not climb through, we could not go through the elevator. So we climbed the staircase, and looking at that staircase, man, it's pretty long. That staircase is so fucking long. We shall, we're going, we're going, we're going. When we now reach 125, if I can, if I can remember, yeah, 125. There was this shrine there where the black people live, where they used to fight the war. Or oh, you may say empire, so that they were fighting war. That, that time, they were fighting war, sure. Not the time we went to him, you know, like those days before they returned to a tourist center. So they lived on that day. And that place is a very small place, like, guys, a small rock holding, carrying a big rock, like. Small road, lifting a big rock. Can't you guys see that God is so wonderful? Like, God is wonderful. So that small rock was holding the big rock, sham. And you see, like, the earth inside, yeah. The earth was inside. And when they do cook, you will see it, the stone, everything, everything. They used to cook. When that place was still smelling of the smoke, they used to fight them. It was literally smelling of the smoke. And I mean, I was even scared. I know this useless, useless imagination was just coming. Like, if this rock collapsed on my head, I've just seen. And by the way, you see that that rock is it? Um, like, no, let me say she is decaying, Abi. She rock is to decaying. I was just said that if this thing should fall down on the on my head, what will happen? Hmm. Well, so we came out. We now saw a passage that could lead upstairs. Like I said, upstairs. We now saw a passage that could lead to the top of the mountain, the peak of it. I mean, I'm this kind of person. I'm scared of height. Like God, if you guys know, you know those pedestrian bridge that's on the road. If I climb there, I don't look down because why? My eyes start turning. So I don't really miss the path at all. If I'm part of the pedestrian bridge, I just go without looking down. So when we we not map we not pass that side again, we not pass the mountain, mm, the staircase. I mean, we pass the staircase side style. We shall went up. We shall went to the. I'm not seeing upstairs. We shall went to the peak of the mountain, the top view. So when we got there, we could see everywhere, like the all over Biokuta, guys. Abelkuta is a very beautiful place, like an Ulumarok. Guys, you guys should visit that place, like, it's so cool, it's everything. You guys have some amazing things, like a lot of amazing things. You guys are going to see them. You guys should just check out that place. So when we now go to the top of it, the peak of the Ulumarok, we now saw a very, we saw the first church, we saw the first box in Abelkuta. We could see everything. We saw Every like I said, we saw everything. We could see everything in Abeokuta, like not the whole of Abeokuta, but we could see at least. Man, Abeokuta is very big, and that mountain is very tall. And when they, they, they said that it was one hundred and seven meter from the sea. Show one hundred and seven. One tree, there yeah, they call it an Iroko tree. They said that tree has been there for over two hundred years, and that tree is still alive. It's still standing. It's still everything, everything. That tree is just perfect. I mean, God is wonderful, guys. God is really wonderful. So we're now there. So me, I was now standing beside one red line. JJ Lee, as a gentle boy. Standing beside one red line. So then I said, ah, we should not pass the red line, no. Because if you pass the red line, you can't sleep and fall off. I was like, whoa. I like, thank God this woman even said it on time. Let's see you not sit on time, cop. Let's say I now move like one or two steps further. Man, 
it will be bad but thank god so that's how we now saw everywhere we could see everything so beautiful we took pictures and everything we just came back down when we came back down man my leg was just crying for help how will you climb 600 and something up 600 and something dive i'm right ah why is it when we got there the lifter was not working like i'm not understanding but man it's a fun place we said climbing the staircase too was actually fun it was so fun yeah 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 it was so 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 fun so when we got down we took drink we calmed down and by the way we took pen and barrier to jot down some stuff and it was so fun yeah Try that place out, man. It's a very beautiful place to go to. Yeah, yeah. So, guys, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, like, comment, share, tell a friend to 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 tell a friend. Yeah. Peace out and have a nice day. Yeah.